recording? Yep. All right. We're doing Cruising the City, Florence today. Florence and Byron. And we're in Florence right now. Oh, yeah. This is Mark, your driver, and John, the cameraman. Oh, yeah. Jonathan, excuse me. Yeah, John. Yeah. Yeah. We just had some delicious Thai food. And we're gonna do a little cruising for y'all. Probably ain't gonna be much better than the Yazoo episode, because there ain't really nothing out here either, but <laughs> hey, we have fun with this shit. Hell yeah. We have fun with this shit. Hell yeah, man. Yeah. Get the leather jacket. Yeah, we got leather jackets on today. A little chilly. It's chillier today than the other than when we did the Yazoo episode. A little chilly, man. We had to get a tie bowl, man. This is uh <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <laughs> this is Florence right now. We're gonna go to Byram from Florence and then back from Byram to Florence. So it's gonna be kind of a two town episode in one. We're doing two different towns in one episode because they're right next to each other, which is fine with us. Let's see. Now we're going through downtown Florence, Mississippi. Some bumpy ass railroad tracks. Oh shit. There you go. <laughs> I'm telling you right now, y'all, ain't, ain't gonna be a real exciting episode. Because <laughs> there ain't really, there's really nothing here to do. There's more to do here than we're out from. Barely. Yeah. <laughs> Not much different. That's just Mississippi for you. Man. Good old Mississippi. It's a beautiful day out here. It's a nice, nice fall day. It's right at 59, 60 degrees, so it's a gorgeous day out. There's the post office of Florence. Very lovely. Yeah. And we're going through the countryside of Florence. Well, Florence is pretty much a countryside. I mean, there's a small, we're not, it's not even a town here. This is considered a village. It's an unincorporated village. So it's not even big as a town. Or not, it's not big enough to even be a town. And this guy behind me is riding on my ass. A lot of people ride at, don't be riding my ass, folks. I don't like that. <laughs> I'm going the speed limit. If they want to get a speeding ticket, let them get it, because I ain't getting one. People don't realize, you know, when you go through here, the speed limit's 30. And uh, you can't be speeding through here, man. Now on these little narrow roads like this. But so sometimes people will fly around you. And uh, it's not, not a good move, because pretty narrow out here, man. It's some nice country out here, ain't it? Oh, yeah. I love my home state. I'm proud to be a Mississippian. Look at that. We got some orange leaves changing over there. So we, we, we get fall colors. Not as vibrant as up north. But we do have uh, color changes in Mississippi when it comes fall. Oh, when, yeah. when it becomes fall. Uh, we get a few. We get a few changes. Get some red and orange leaves in there. And it's been pretty chilly. We, did, we do get cold in Mississippi, just not like snow and all that like up north. We just get the cold, which is actually nicer. Makes it a lot easier to drive through. I lived up north. I lived in Massachusetts for three years. And man, it snows all the time up there. Like you actually get tired of the snow. <laughs> we, it can snow in Mississippi. But we only get like a few inches if it does. We don't get like feet of snow or something. Like feet, we don't get one or two feet of snow. But we've had a snowstorm a few times and we had, we had a snowstorm and we got about uh, six, seven inches of snow one year a few years ago. Even in central Mississippi, we got snow like that. So, uh, let's see. 
Now we're going to more country of Florence. That's pretty much all Florence is, country, country, country. Yeah. Got a few houses here and there, cow pastures, horses. Very, very lovely, folks. The, the Taj Mahal. Taj Mahal. Taj Mahal. Now, folks, <laughs> that's a Taj Mahal. Right? <laughs> I've seen, I've seen Taj Mahal, folks, but that was the Taj Mahal. Here's it. What's up, boy? What's up, boy? Long hair boy. Long hair dude driving, driving <laughs> out here in the country. Long hair boy driving. <laughs> oh, man. This episode is probably going to be more boring than the Azu, dude. <laughs> Shoot, Lord. This guy is riding my ass. There's this dude behind me riding my ass, and I'm going the speed limit. I'm not speeding for nobody, dude. You can go around me, you, you can get a ticket, I'm not. You don't pay my bills. Hell no. Oh, it's nice weather, man. We got we finally can wear the leather jackets, finally. Yeah. And it's been too warm. Usually we don't get chilly until uh, mid-October, late October, that's when we start getting chilly in, in Mississippi. But we do get cold here. But man, our summers are a bitch. Oh yeah. I mean, it's hot as balls in the summer. Oh yeah. Man, I'm talking about like, it'll be 95 degrees. I feel like 120. With a heat index of, no, not that hot, but we'll get a heat index of about 100, 105, some days in the summer. And you talking about hot, buddy. And now we're on the outskirts of Florence. We're gonna be on we're gonna be in Byram soon. This is gonna be a double town episode for y'all. Yeah, we're doing two damn towns in one day. I'll be damned. <laughs> what is this Byram? No, we're still in Florence. Uh, I'll let you know. Still gotta wait a bit. But we're approaching the Florence-Byram border. We're basically going from Rankin County to Hines County. Because Byram is in uh, Hines County. Florence is in Rankin County. Hey, look at that lovely uh, bridge here, Jonathan. Oh, yeah. We got lakes here. A little lake back there. lake over here. Look at that lake. Oh, yeah. Very nice. It's nice. I I would live over here too. It's real nice. Yeah. Good old Mississippi. Good old Mississippi. Nothing like being in a red state, let me tell you. God yeah. bless the South. Mm -hmm. Let's see. We're at a four way stop here. And go. That guy better quit right. Oh, he's turning good. Or not, I don't know. Some dude was like riding my riding on me very closely. Like big old redneck failure. In the yeah. Truck. <laughs> <laughs> well, he can take his he can take his redneck ass and go around me too. He can drive around me if he wants. He can get a speeding ticket. I ain't speeding. I'm going right at the speed limit. He's like, what? He's like, you got that Bud Light, buddy? Yeah, you got some Bud look at Light. This, look at this. Hell yeah, look at that. Mm -hmm. I want some Bud. I want some Bud Light, boy. That's good Bayer, man. Hell I'll yeah. tell you what. Got them Trump flags. We got our Confederate flags. <laughs> yeah, you see a lot of that out here. There's some country folks out here. Hell yeah, we like we like our flag, boy. Oh yeah. We like our flag out here, boy. <laughs> it's the pride of the cell. I'm proud to be a southern man. We ain't no Yankees, son. 
Nope. <laughs> Look at that lake. Now, that's oh. nice. Now, that's that's a, a beautiful lake. Yeah, look at that. Well, not really a lake. That's actually like a pond, but it still looks nice. A little pond. We got more country than Florence. We're like on the very outskirts of Florence now. It ain't nothing but country out here. Oh, yeah. Don't cut it, Jonathan. We're gonna keep recording, man. It's gonna be one long clip. No, I ain't. Cut it off. No. I'm, all right. <laughs> Undated. Undated footage for y'all because we're bullshit productions. <laughs> <laughs> we don't give a fuck. We don't give a fuck. <laughs> and this guy's riding my ass again. Damn it. I wish he would just go around me, dude. I don't like when people do that. Some people just don't care. Whatever. All right, let's see. We are going to be approaching Hines County here in a minute. We're still in Rankin County. But we're going to be uh, seeing Byram here in a minute. Got some lovely uh, trees for y'all to see. Lots of trees. Oh, yeah. Some of them are starting to change color from the fall. And right now, it is 59 degrees and it's a beautiful, gorgeous fall day. Look at that, John. That's a lot of that's a lot of fuel, man. Yeah. Yeah, go around me, thank you. This is a dude that's been riding my ass. <laughs> no turn signal. And he just passed on a double yellow line. Nice move. No turn signal either. No turn signal. He passed on a double yellow line. You're not supposed to pass people when it's a double salad line like that. You know? That's dangerous, man, because you can't see who's come, who's driving around that corner like that and you're passing someone. Yeah. That's not a good move. You never know. Watch. It could be a big-ass 18 wheel or something, and boom, you're going to be in trouble. Yeah. <laughs> I would have laughed. Man, we got that on film. <laughs> uh, that would be a little scary. Okay, we're leaving Rankin County. Now we're in Hans County. This is Byram. I told it's going to be a double town episode. Florence and Byram mixed. And we're going to do some more episodes, guys. This ain't it. We're going to do some more. We'll just drive around Mississippi or, you know, maybe, you know, going in another state. We'll go to another state eventually. But mostly we're going to do Mississippi just because we live here. Yeah. So we're pretty much going to do, like, a lot of different towns in Mississippi. Is your arm tired, Jonathan? Yeah. You okay? Yeah, it's fine. All right. I just did, I did a lot of work out. Yeah. I really well, we won't make it a super long episode or nothing. And some more railroad tracks. Boom, boom. City of Byram. Now we're in Byram, y'all. Hines County. Hines County. I like Rankin County better, personally. Yeah. <laughs> it's more country out there. It's a little more quiet. But it's alright over here, it ain't bad. You got more like stores over here and stuff, and restaurants. Whew! Uh, why is this guy out in the middle of a damn road? 
Oh no, look at his stupid Dude, ass. Dude, can you like pull in? That's look dangerous. Look at his stupid ass. God. God, he's stupid. <laughs> what a dumbass. <laughs> <laughs> you gonna, gonna stay out? Oh shit. Kind of look around a bit, like side views and stuff. And look at this long hair motherfucker right here. I'm Mark the driver. <laughs> <laughs> I know I'm looking damn mighty fine myself, I must say. I got my leather jacket on. I got, I got my hair all smooth and a ponytail boy. <laughs> <laughs> damn. That Thai food, man. That Thai food, man. That was, that was good. good. I'm both sad. <laughs> yeah, it was damn That's good. That's good eating, man. That's some damn good Chinese right there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What? Uh oh, someone's calling Jonathan now. I don't understand. Isn't that the old Street Fighter theme from uh, old Nintendo, Super Nintendo? Yeah. Uh, that's where I recognize Street, it. Street Fighter 2. Street Fighter, yeah. That's the character selection theme for Street I Fighter I remember that. Too. Yeah, that's my ringtone, man. You and JJ are alike. He likes a lot of them. He likes a lot of those 8-bit Nintendo sounds. Yeah. He likes to do that. Yes. Sometimes he has some dumb rednecks that would be like, Thailand, what part of China is that in? What, is that? <laughs> what part of China is that in? Canada? <laughs> I, mean, I, I mean, hell, I'm Southern, but I know the differences in Asian culture. Yeah. I mean. Exactly. There's more There's more in Asia than there's China, folks. You got Thailand, Japan, India, all them, all them awesome countries. Yeah, it's all a part of Asia. Personally, my favorite... Mm, I don't know, Jonathan. My favorite would have to be uh, Indian and Japanese. As far as food? Yeah. I like Japanese. But and Thai and Korean Thai. are real close. I like I like all of them pretty much. I know. They're all good. You can't go wrong. Asian food in general is just so damn good. And Mexican food. I love Mexican food, man. Fajitas. Like shrimp, Italian shrimp. food. Italian's okay, but it's not my favorite. I'm just not real big on pasta. Yeah. I have to be in the mood for it. Yeah. You Mark, like Mark, Mark likes that skeddy, man. I, like, I want some skeddy. <laughs> With some garlic bread. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we had an old, I ain't gonna say his name, but one of my ex-best friends, he was such a damn picky eater. I mean, one time I made fresh grilled hamburgers on the grill in my backyard, and I said, okay, dinner's ready. And this dude has the nerve to say, uh, I'm not really craving burgers, Mark. Can we go down to Pizza Hut so I can get some spaghetti bowl or something? So we make fun of him. We're like, I want some skeddy, man. I want some skeddy. Take me to get that there skeddy. Because he was real country. I mean, I got a southern accent, but this dude was country. He was like, I want some spaghetti. <laughs> <laughs> some garlic bread. <laughs> Damn, boy. And now we're going through Byram, Mississippi. Byram. Byram. <laughs> it's a nice area. It's all right. I just prefer Rankin County. But this place, this place is uh, nice, too. Byram's a little closer to Jackson. Oh, yeah. But it's a good area. And we're going to drive by my old house, my old neighborhood where I used to live, but I'm not going to I'm not gonna show, show you which house is mine just to protect the people living in it. I don't want them to... I don't want to point my house on camera. But we'll drive by it. You just don't, you won't know which house is mine, just my old neighborhood. I think about stuff like that, you know, I don't want to, if someone else is living in it, I don't want to point the house out, you know what I mean? Yeah. Just like we showed my, we showed my old house in the Azu too, but I didn't, we didn't point it out. But I'll go through the neighborhood. <laughs> I want some. He's like, Skitty. this dude was like, man, I'm not really craving burgers, Mark. I was thinking more skeddy. Skeddy. 
you that skitty. I want some skitty. You know, with some of that cheesy garlic bread. Some skitty, boy. I want some skitty. <laughs> skitty. With some meatballs and sauce. <laughs> <laughs> This is a nice church. Very lovely. That's a big church. Man, that's a that's a got a crowd there today, that's a, that's boy. That's a nice looking church. Got a lot of people. You know, I'm a you know, I'm not a super religious man. I'm not a super religious man, but I do believe in the good Lord Jesus Christ. Yep. And I am a Christian man. Mm. So is Jonathan. Yep. We believe in the Lord. We're just not Bible thumpers or nothing like that. Oh man. Yeah, somebody trying to follow you. This is Byron. We're still in Byron. <laughs> in Byron, boy. And we'll, uh, what we'll do is we'll go through Byron a little bit. Yeah. And then we'll make our way back to Florence. We can film a little bit of Florence again. Then we'll uh, end the video. Give us about 20 minutes, Jonathan. We'll be good. <laughs> Can you hold it a little longer? Yeah. All right. Okay, I don't know what the speed limit is on this road. Uh, 35. I don't know. I didn't really see no signs. I think it's 35. Yeah. This is nice back here. This is the old way I used to go home. My old neighborhood. And it's pretty country out here, too. And it's pretty nice out here, John. Yeah. A lot of trees. That's one thing Mississippi's got. A lot of trees, a lot of woods. And we got some dogs eating garbage. Yeah. What the, what, what the hell? <laughs> a goblin on some garbage, man. Look like some stray dogs. Exciting, y'all. Looks like we got more Amish neighborhoods. <laughs> I like seeing those Trump flags, man. I like that. Oh, yeah. We support Trump in this vehicle. And the Confederate flag. Yep. Mm. And the American flag. I'm proud to be American. I'm proud to be a Southerner. Hell yeah. And if you don't like it, that's tough shit. Kiss our rebel ass. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's right. Mm. We don't give a shit what y'all think. We don't give a shit, I man. don't change. They ain't, they ain't turning our place into a blue state. Hell no. no I don't on. change for nobody. You either like me or don't. You don't. You don't like what I support? Don't be my friend then. At the end of the day, I'm not gonna lose. I'm not gonna worry about it. If someone doesn't like me for who I am, I don't really give a shit. To be honest with you. All right, we gotta watch out on this road, man. You got a lot of bumps. This road is so old. It, it needs. It looks like it needs a lot of repair. I just don't want to hit no big ass pothole and mess up my tire or something. Got a little turbulence here, folks. Huh? <laughs> Round some turbulence. Te technical difficulty here, folks. A little turbulence here, folks. Yeah. Speed limit's 40, actually. Okay, speed limit's 40. I'm going like 35. Oh, shit, I forgot about that bump. There you go. Uh, it's a little well, like curve. At least I took that weight out of here. <laughs> yeah. All right, it's got to be careful on this road. A lot of, a lot of holes on this road. A little turbulence, folks. <laughs> it's gonna be a bumpy ride. It's our wonderful Mississippi roads right here. I know we got yeah, the best full, roads in America, y'all. Full tell swing me. right here. Oh, we got shit. a wonderful. Mississippi Department, Highway Department. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. Ooh. Just gotta be real careful. 
I gotta go a little slower because I don't want to hit in all these potholes. Good lord. Yeah, I know. I don't miss you. I bet you don't miss the terrible roads in Byron. Huh? No. <laughs> I used to live in Hines County for three years, and I moved to Rankin County. I'm not gonna tell you which town I live in, but I'm in Rankin County now. That's all you need to know. All right, let's see. But it's all right over here. What's yes. up, brother? What's sure. going on, bud? <laughs> What's going on, bud? What's going on, man? See some light. Bud Light? Need a light, man? I need a Bud Light, bud. He's like, you need a light, boy? <laughs> bud Light. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you gonna let me go? Thank you, sir. You need a light, boy? A Bud Light. <laughs> I need a Bud Light. Beer. I want some cold burr. <laughs> <laughs> right, we're gonna go in my old neighborhood. You remember this, don't you, Jonathan? Oh, been, yeah. Been a while since you've been over here. Oh, yeah. All right, no, it's not this one. Next one. Oh, yeah, I remember God, that. dog, these roads suck ass. Don't miss these roads. Yeah. No. Remember this. Oh, yeah. Slow way down. <laughs> I know I gotta slow down, man. This road, God, these roads are horrible. You gotta limp it, limp God. your, limp your truck on through here, man. I'm telling you. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I know. It, this road needs some bad repair. It's like in rough shape. You have to go real slow because you don't. They're hot. Man, these road, these bad roads. All right, wait a minute, bud. I'm go around you. Hold on. All right. These roads are in such bad shape that they'll tear up your tires if you go too fast on them. Oh, shit. Wait a minute. Gotta let UPS man go. All right. These roads are very narrow. We're gonna take y'all by Terry Road here in a minute. Oh right? hell no! <laughs> take your own ass down Terry Road. I, I won't even go down there. Hell no! I hate Jackson. Jackson, Mississippi, is a shithole. I will never. I, I hate even going through there. That's gotta be the one of the worst cities in Mississippi. Jackson, yeah. But this ain't Jackson. We we can buy somebody it. doing a little cooking over here. All right, a little barbecue. We are gonna stop by for some ribs. <laughs> <laughs> I want some barbecue ribs with, with some hamburgers. And uh, it's very very lovely out here. Yeah. This road is horrible. Look, <laughs> oh God. All right, I'm just gonna, t I'm taking through my old neighborhood. I ain't, gonna, I ain't gonna tell you which house was mine, but this road <laughs> sucks ass. Yeah. But it ain't bad back here. It's pretty country out here. All right, I'm gonna go around the son of a bitch. Man, it's like quiet as hell out here. Oh shit. Bumpy, bumpy, bumpy road. All right, we're gonna, let's go back. Oh shit. <laughs> Technically, this is Jackson right here. We're, we're just out of the Byron line, barely though. Just barely in the Jackson. But we're going back to Byron. Hold on, folks. <laughs> this is actually Jackson, but we're barely out of Byron. I can deal with the outskirts of Jackson. 
but uh that's about it I, like I said Jackson is not a good okay guy you need to slow down there bud yeah going too fast around that corner all right we're gonna take our asses on out of here <laughs> nope. there's a there's a key <laughs> just saw a black cat I love I love cats black cats going around Halloween Halloween I, love it. I know we got like two days of Halloween What's today? October 29th? Yep. But today and tomorrow, it's Halloween. Are we gonna start heading back to Byram here. Get back in Florence. Oh yeah. Oh shit. A little turbulence here, folks. <laughs> Nothing to worry about. <laughs> God, these ro these roads are just horrible, man. Right, I know. Let's get the hell out of here. They do a wonderful job on the roads in Mississippi. We got, yeah, some, very, we got very some of the best roads in the country out here. <laughs> very lovely. Can y'all tell? <laughs> very, very lovely roads. Very. Yeah. Damn, it's 57 degrees, Jonathan. Damn. Damn, it got colder. It's getting colder by the day. Oh, is it? Yeah, because that that tropical storm moved out. Now it's getting colder. 57 now, huh? Damn. Is it really? Yeah. It says it on my Jeep. Damn. It's 57 degrees right now, and it feels wonderful. That's crazy. I would let the window down. But we don't want all that wind sound. Because if you let, if I let the window down, y'all gonna hear a bunch of wind, and that'll be kind of annoying, actually. But I got the fan on, so I'm getting the cool air from outside. And this hair vehicle. <laughs> oh yeah. We got a lot of trees. A lot of trees. A lot of trees. Mississippi is mostly trees, boy. We're very. Y'all see mostly trees and like road construction and stuff. We're a very <laughs> rural state. Okay, now we're now we're back in Byram. See, we barely we went outside of Byram just barely into Jackson. We are gonna go left. The Florence. Well, Byron. We're still in Byron. Oh, yeah. We're going to be in Byron for a little bit. Then we'll be back in Florence. Oh, shit. Very bumpy. Yeah, we got plenty of good footage. We'll have to uh, edit the video. Well, not edit it, but just put it on YouTube or whatever. We're not editing shit. This is all the footage. And we did Yazoo City a few days ago, two days ago. We did a re-recording because we didn't really get a good video last year. And this guy is hauling ass. No, I'm just kidding. Uh... He did pull out kind of fast. <laughs> um, That's what she said. <laughs> no, no comment. Uh, <laughs> Jonathan, you're being ridiculous. You're being ridiculous. <laughs> Grandma old goody, but <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, we're out this little... See, my grandma, she's got this uh, bag full of candy. Like, she's a big sweets person. And we and she she calls it her goodie bag, like you know, all the goodies and sweets and chocolates and candies and all that. So I was uh, eating a little bit out of it, and Jonathan made a joke. He said, "Boy, grandma, grandma's gonna be like, who? Ain't? Grandma's gonna look at us and go, who been grandma's goodie bag? <laughs> <laughs> and she's gonna kick our ass too. Grandma don't play. You don't be eating grandma's chocolate and cookies. She's gonna be like, Mark." You been grandma's goodie bag? I'm missing some cookies and some Twix in here. <laughs> <laughs> she 
she gonna turn in the cane and choke slam your ass to hell. <laughs> <laughs> she gonna become a wrestler and start body slamming us like, boy, you been in my cookies. <laughs> <laughs> Grandma don't play, boy. No. We got it. <laughs> Grandma. Grandma's goodie bag. Grandma's goodie bag. <laughs> <laughs> and she gonna be like, who the hell been in my goodie? Who been who been eating my cookies and been, my, my damn Twix? Who been gobbling my goodies out my bag? <laughs> <laughs> Man, that don't sound right. <laughs> Grandma's goodies, that don't sound right. Oh man. But anyway, we are having some fun doing this shit. I tell you what, I don't what? know if it's really that fun, actually. Boy, I tell you what. Man. I'll tell you, but I'll tell you what. <laughs> tell you what, boy. <laughs> Another church coming up. Very lovely. That's one thing Mississippi's got. A lot of churches. We got the chicken churches and the churches. <laughs> <laughs> got yep. both of them. We got both of them. You go one for eating, for eating chicken, you go one to praise the Lord. I like Church's Chicken. They're pretty good, man. I like their honey biscuits. Oh, yeah. Uh, it's a southern thing. It's a southern thing. And we got some stores here. What do we got? Kroger. You grow up down in the south, you're going to have some fried chicken every once wings. in a while. Right? We got a wing place and a Kroger grocery store over here. Very, very lovely. Oh, man. <laughs> Very nice. Very nice. <laughs> and now we're coming to a stoplight. It's a very nice stoplight. Very nice. Very nice line, line of traffic here. We got a lot of traffic. And we got another dollar store up here. Jesus Christ, how many store, dollar stores uh, in Mississippi the, got? The Dollar Tree. The, well, that Dollar right General. The Dollar General stalking us, man, I tell you. I'm telling you what. It's son. on every street corner. I tell you what, son, they're everywhere. I know they are. Put my hat back on. Man, we got stuck at the red Some light, boy. Mm. Y'all like my hat? Yeah. Yeah. That's long hair. Got a long haired country boy next to me. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Damn right, son. I'm proud of it too. I'm proud to be a metalhead. I'm proud to be a southern rocker. Proud to be a country boy. And my boy Jonathan's a country boy too. Oh yeah. <laughs> my Irish brother from another mother. Hell yeah. <laughs> man. It is a nice day. It's a really nice day out today. Man. It is. See, I like... I like driving around when it gets nice and chilly out and cold. When it's summertime, I just, I'm not a summer person, guys. I like to be out when it's cold. You know, naturally being Scandinavian and Celtic descent, I'm not real fond of the hot weather. I like it cold. Yeah. I like chilly, cold weather. I can't do it. I'm mostly, I'm mostly Celt. Scandinavian. Oh yeah, mm. we are both Scandinavian and Celtic. Yeah, I'm a little more Mark here. I'm a little more Scandinavian than Celt, and Jonathan's opposite. He's more Celt, but also some Scandinavian. So that's cool. That's cool as hell, man. You can see why we don't like the heat too much. Yeah, <laughs> we're just not with our heritage. We're not meant for hot weather. Like I'm one of those guys that if I lay out and try to tan in the sun, I just turn real red. Turn turn into a lobster. I'll turn in the into sun. a damn lobster. Oh yeah. And we're still in Byram, guys. This is Byram, Mississippi. Byram. Byram. And Byram. Yeah, boy. Yeah. We're having. <laughs> <laughs>
We're having a very lovely day. Lovely day. Yeah. Got some Thai food. Going. Thai food. Cruising around. Cruising. Cruising Byron. And cruising Florence. We're, we'll be in Florence in a little while, but we're going backwards. And when we get, uh, when we get back to Florence, we'll just drive around in the country a little bit, and we're gonna we're gonna go ahead and end the video. Yeah, because it, it all looks the same pretty much. It ain't, there ain't really nothing to see except country, country, and more country. We ain't, we're not city boys. We don't live in a big city, and I thank the Lord for that because I am not a city guy. Yeah, I like country. I'm a redneck. I like being in peace. <laughs> I don't see how people live in the city, man. We ain't got you ain't got no country, no woods to breathe. I like natural, fresh country air. You got people stacked on top of you, man. I know. I, I don't in the like the city. This I mean, I don't understand how people live out in the city, man. To be I mean, honest, man. it's a to be to be that jam packed. I've lived in Dallas, Fort Worth before, man. I can tell you, it's. It's not enjoyable. If you want to do no. something, you got 600,000 other people that want to go do the same yeah. thing. And then they're going to all be in traffic next to you, you know? Mm. We're just mm. cruising some more Byram here. We got a KFC coming up. Very, very nice. Let's see who all is in there. <laughs> we got some people. What's going on, y'all? Oh man, that KFC. There we got O'Reilly, boy. They must have looted that KFC. That's Irish. We got oh somebody O'Reilly. Somebody oh, must have Irish. looted that KFC, man. There's nobody there. <laughs> must throw all the chicken out. Oh man. <laughs> uh, sir, what, what's what's the call complaint? Oh, we got this here fella. He ate some chicken. Stole all my chicken out of he, my he KFC. Stole, he, he stole my chicken. <laughs> And uh, I'm very, I'm very sad. He stole all my fried chicken, sir. All right. <laughs> oh, we got a little Hollywood, Hollywood audition action. right here. <laughs> <laughs> we, got, we got some dude walking on the side of the road. We got a make, we got a make a D's on the left here. Chick Fil A. Look, get a picture. Shot of, uh, there's Old Glory. God bless America. Oh yeah. That's awesome. That's a big flag too. I like that. You got to pick up Byram City Hall. Yeah. Half a mile from here. 0.5 miles. Byram City Hall. Well, wouldn't that be 0.5 mile, not miles? That yeah. don't sound right. It's yeah. not even one mile. <laughs> yeah. We got Walgreens, Exxon. Waffle House. Waffle House. Oh, Lord. There's Terry Road right here. It goes all the way to Byron. Terry Road. It goes all the way into Byron from Jackson. Let's see. Dun, dun, dun. dun. We are heading back towards Rankin County. Love a shot of the, there's a highway there. Yeah. That's 55 North going into Jackson. Yeah. This is so exciting. <laughs> Let's go to Jackson. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Hell no. Jackson is not a good area. We're going to take y'all down south, Jackson. We're going to go like the worst part of town. <laughs> Jackson has a lot of bad parts, don't they? <laughs> oh, yeah. That place is like, 
horrible. Yeah, guys, if you're not if you're not from Mississippi and you want to drive around Mississippi, don't you ever ever go to Jackson. Yeah. Go up the go up to the Delta. That's a nice park. Very quiet. Very nice folks up there. Or go to the coast. Go see Biloxi. That's all right. But whatever you do, stay away from Jackson. Yeah. Hey, Jonathan grieved me on that. Oh yeah. That's that pretty, place is it's a pretty shit bad. Place. It's pretty bad. Used to not be that bad, but You're it's gotten a lot there, worse. It's gotten a lot worse. There's a Capital Body Shop. You see, now we're heading towards back to Rankin County. The Capital Body Shop is native to Mississippi, too. Oh, it is? Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. Look at this church. Oh, yeah. That's a nice church. First Baptist bar. We have a lot of Southern Baptists in the South and Methodists. Those are, I would say, that's the two most religions that Southerners are. You're gonna be Southern Baptist, or you're gonna be Methodist. But you got other things too: Catholic, Mormon. You got other, but that's like the main two. But when it comes down to it, religion ain't really important. It's more about believing in the good Lord. That's the main important part. Oh, there's another railroad. Oh, shit. <laughs> Very bumpy. And basically, we're going back the same way we came, except the opposite way. Yep. We're just going to keep filming because this is Bullshit Productions. Yep. Jonathan, what were we, we brought to you by? Bullshit Productions. Bullshit Productions. <laughs> so we don't give a fuck. <laughs> <laughs> fun man hell yeah we're gonna do, trees. like I said we're gonna do more episodes in Mississippi guys this ain't the only one I promise you but I'll tell you what we ain't gonna do no cruising the city of Jackson oh no <laughs> <laughs> you have to pay me to do one episode there cuz I'm scared of Jackson I don't like Jackson we might we might do one if, if they have a St. Patrick's Day parade next year, we might, yeah. we might do one where See, we're walking around. It. Walking it sucks around. they had to cancel it this year. Yeah, the coronavirus. Yeah. That coronavirus is bullshit. It pretty much ruined a lot of plans this year for everybody. No concerts, no festivals, no parades. But yeah, yeah if, they get, if they get it going next year and they get that St. Patrick's Day parade next year, we're going to... We're going to film it for y'all, a little bit of it at least. Oh, yeah. Show you kind of what Jackson looks like during the daytime, but you don't want to walk at night through there. No. We're going to go and we're going to go to Florence. We're going to drive into, you know, a parking lot or something or streets or something, just kind of film a little bit inside of Florence. There's, that's, there ain't really nothing there. Yeah. But it's a nice little country village. Yeah. I need to stop. I don't know. What the hell's going on? Are they trying to turn or something? Uh, let this bus turn. Yeah, the school kid. Rankin County School. I was being a gentleman letting the bus go. I thought they were trying to stop and let some kids off, but I guess they ain't. I guess they were just turning. Just turn it around. It's usually when you know when the bus stops and the stop sign comes out, that's when you have to stop. <laughs> but I, I guess they're just they're turning. Oh well. Turn it around. Turn it around. That's one thing about Southerners, we're very hospitable people. You know, we're uh, we're the kind of people that's gonna say, hey, how you doing? Yeah. We're not, we don't like being strangers down here. We're not rude. We just like saying, hey, how you doing? Yeah. They don't really do that up north too much. I used to live up north, whenever I used to live up north, 
I would try to be, you know, I would show my southern hospitality. I'd be like, hey, how are y'all doing? How's it going? And people up there would be like, I'm fine. Like, they don't want to be bothered, so I just quit doing it. Because people, I got, I got plenty of, I got family and friends up north. I have no problem if you're from somewhere else, but they don't tend to be as friendly as southerners do. And I think Jonathan will agree with me on that. Oh, yeah. Mm. Southerners are just a lot more friendlier because we're more old school when it comes to manners and stuff. We say yes sir, no sir, yes ma'am, no ma'am. That's just the kind of folks we are down here. Yeah. That's what we grew up doing. We grew up respecting our elders. Yeah. And the thing is up north, people don't like to be called Mr. and Mrs. They like to be called by their first names, which I found kind of funny. Cause it, it just felt weird calling an old person by their first name because that's not what I'm used to doing. Yeah. Like I had some lady up there tell me her name and I said, Mrs. whatever her name was. She's like, no, it's just, it's just my first name. I'm like, okay, well, that's what y'all like. I mean, I'll call y'all by your first name, but in the South, you can't do that. Yeah. <laughs> and it'll be rude. Yeah. It's a cultural deal. It's a cultural difference between the South and the North. It is. Because if you call, if you call an old folk by their first name down here, they're gonna go, "You're rude, man." Yeah. <laughs> they don't like that down here. You better say Mr. Mrs. or Miss. Yeah. You know, you say Mr. Mrs. down in the south. And then you say thank you and thank stuff. Thank you, please. Yeah. We they don't, don't say all that up there. They don't do it up north, no. I mean, they do in some smaller areas, like smaller towns. They're pretty nice up north, but overall, we're a lot nicer down here, I would say. Yeah. And after living in Massachusetts for three years, y'all, I had to come back to the south. I, you know, I was born and raised in Mississippi, and I wanted to try something different. So I went away for a few years. I moved up north. I didn't like it in the end, so I came back to the south. Now I'm back in Mississippi. I'm yeah. back home. Oh yeah. I missed home, man. After about two years of living up there, I knew I had to come back to the south. Cause you miss home. It made it made me appreciate home a lot more moving away for a bit. Oh, Although yeah. now we're on the Byron Florence border. So we're about to be in Florence again, y'all. And we're gonna go cruising around Florence for a bit too, and then we're gonna go on home. Look at that lake. That's a nice lake right there. Oh, yeah. Well, it's cool because we get the feeling from both ways. We came this way on the way up. Now we're going back on the way down so y'all can see different angles of it. Look at that. That's nice, man. Hell yeah. Yeah, look at that. And now y'all see why I live in the country versus the city. Yeah. yeah. The city folks don't have nothing but a concrete jungle, yeah, man. Yeah, they don't have nothing like this. Look, we got some red and orange leaves on the tree. Very nice. Yeah, so we get a little bit. It turns more around October. Yeah. Late October or well, early November. Yeah. Up north, it changes like late September, early October. In the south, our fall, our leaves change late October, early November. Yeah. But we do get color change. We get fall foliage. Foliage. It's just not as early as they get it up there. Yeah. Now we are back in Florence. Florence is uh, more country than Byron is. It's, a, it's like, you know Florence is not even half the size of Byron? <laughs> Byron is actually considered a small town. Florence is only a village. It's not even a town. Yeah. <laughs> it's not even big enough to be called a town. We got an old uh, cemetery here. Very nice. A lot of uh, Democratic ballots are cast over there. Yeah. You know, <laughs> that wouldn't surprise me at all. We had this guy vote for president that died back in like 1902. Yeah. <laughs> What's his birthday? 1902. But he still happened to vote for Joe Biden somehow. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's Democrats for you. They'll use a dead man's name on a ballot. Yep. Mm -hmm. 
Florence is very nice. We got a nice curve here. Whoa. <laughs> you know, sometimes some people be flying around that curve, man. Oh, yeah. Like a dumbass. You gotta watch them. Yeah. They did that when I was up in West Virginia, too. Man. They did? Yeah. They fly around the corner. And it's real. You don't ever. Okay, never mind. Now, technically, we're in, we just saw the Welcome to Florence sign. That was still yeah. by. That's like, well, actually, no, that's considered Florence back there, but it's like out of the city limits. It's like the outskirts of Florence. Now we're just in the city. We're in the city limits of Florence. I got a buddy who lives back here. Back in that lake over there where he just passed. Yeah. One of my buddies lives over there. We usually have a bunch of cows out here. I don't know where they at. I guess they're inside or something. Another, we're brought to you by another church here, folks. <laughs> oh yeah. You see churches everywhere. But I have no problem with that at all. Because it lets you know what kind of people are around here. You can definitely tell the difference in the roads between Florence, Florence and Byron. Florence and Byron, yeah. Man. The Florence roads are much nicer. And not as bumpy either. Rankin County just has nicer roads than Hines County does. Period. Yeah, we're gonna be done. We're gonna be done soon, man. Just a little longer. <laughs> Your arm's starting to hurt. Yeah. We're just gonna do a little more footage, all right? Then we'll be done. Hey, I just saw Domino's delivery, man. I want, I want some pizza. Some pizza. I want some pizza. Some skeddy, man. Skeddy. I want some skeddy. I don't want that there pizza. Some <laughs> skeddy and French bread. <laughs> <laughs> I, want some, I want some skeddy and French bread. He's like, I want some skeddy and French bread. <laughs> <laughs> I like skeddy with, with, with that meatballs and He's like, I want, I want some of the haters. <laughs> I want some for haters. <laughs> It's not like you say haters. He's like, but haters. I want some for haters. But haters. he's trying to say, but he's trying to say like fajitas, but he gonna say I want some for haters. Yeah, it sounds like he says for haters. For <laughs> haters. I want some for haters. <laughs> I want some for haters, boy. <laughs> I want that bread bowl, French bowl, possible. <laughs> skitty. Put that skitty in that bread bowl. <laughs> Throw some fajitas on top for extra flavor. <laughs> we gonna have us a Mexican Italian mixed dish. <laughs> We're gonna call it Mex Italian. Bullshit. <laughs> bullshit Productions, motherfucker. This is bullshit productions, y'all. Hell yeah, man. Mm, that little we got downtown Florence here. Oh yeah, you got a little old buildings right here. Check Very this out. old around here. Yeah, check. I brought it to you by another church. Check that out, man. That's what a nice church building. right there. We are in downtown Florence, Mississippi. Yo. I love Florence. Such a nice area. Very country, and the folks are good. Can't you know everyone? You know, very small town where everyone knows each other. And that's where I grew up. I grew up in Yazoo, up in the Delta. Like I said in my other video, but uh, I just like being in places where people are nice, man. As long as they ain't the big city, I'm happy. I'll always be a small towner guy. We got the country village. 
we're gonna go in the Ramies. Well, not go in Ramies, but we're gonna drive by in the parking lot and then just come out. Yeah. <laughs> we're gonna go on the side street for y'all. We got this here place called Ramies. Ramies is a local grocery store in Florence. Very lovely. <laughs> Some guys pulling out in front of me. <laughs> Did you even look? <laughs> He's totally oblivious, man. Look at oh, like, dirt. Like, that's just that's just back up into my damn vehicle. <laughs> good thing I got good eye coordination. We're gonna go through the parking lot like an asshole because we're bored. <laughs> Yeah. We're gonna go through this neighborhood. Well, not a neighborhood, but parking lot. We're gonna go through the parking lot like an asshole. <laughs> <laughs> that guy's from Simpson County. Got a church right here. Look at that. Got, that's a nice church, bro. You can go to. Go get your groceries and go to church, man. Yep. That's what you do. <laughs> Amen, sir. All right, let's see. Oh, shit. Hmm. Right this here, redneck feller from Simpson County. <laughs> oh. We got some pretty good footage, man. Oh yeah. All right, we're on. Start heading back towards the house. We're about we're gonna do a little more filming, but not much. construction right back on the highway <laughs> the thing about the road construction out here is they don't get done with it in one year you know it takes them about five ten five, years, ten years. <laughs> five ten years once they start doing the road construction. yeah they're working on the uh, man's bumpy yeah they're doing some uh construction so the roads are a, a bit bumpy about five, ten years left on those road construction. Yeah. Done, you know? They say it's going to be done in two years. It's more like five years. Yeah. <laughs> Whenever they say two years, you're looking about ten years. Right? Lord. I'm back on the highway. That's a restaurant. It's called Jerry Seafood. That's a. It's like a big igloo. Yeah, it's like a big igloo full of food, man. That's what it is. And it's just, it's just terrible. It's you know? incredible. It's like the most terrible food you ever ate in your life. It's like full of. It's full inside of an igloo. You walk in, and <laughs> a bunch of, bunch of cottage cheese and <laughs> cream cheese and all. That. <laughs> no, it's no. He's just kidding. It's all right. But I've been told it's. I have to try their food out, man. It sounds pretty good. They got like good catfish and seafood and stuff. <laughs> I have to try it out. <laughs> Another church. And we got some guy going really fast on the highway. Got a speed racer over here. <laughs> Just got his driver's license. Let <laughs> me see that license, son. Going too fast. You take. You gotta take this IQ test. And he's like, oh, you failed with flying colors. Fail. 
Oh, you scored a negative 900 on your IQ test? <laughs> oh, well, here's, a, here's the keys to a brand new Mustang, and here's your license for you. <laughs> oh, God. Remind me not to be on the road when he's driving. <laughs> That'd be scary. That's some scary shit. That's that's what that that's what I was saying about that Mustang that we saw. Oh, oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Hey, not everyone can drive too good. And that's what scares me. Yeah. <laughs> look at look at the. Up a country out here, country highway. I'm gonna drive to this nice park and then we're gonna end the video there just so y'all can see how lovely Florence is. <laughs> we'll, we'll go, uh, we'll check out this little, we'll go to this nice little neighborhood and they got a lake and a uh, park here. Yeah. I'm gonna get over here. Maybe change lanes here. <laughs> Old country store. Look at all the roosters. <laughs> Bunch of roosters right Bunch there. of roosters. Yeah, they come to snuff the rooster. Yeah. Courtesy of uh, Alice in Chains. <laughs> <laughs> Alice in Chains kicks ass. Oh, yeah. Especially the old 90s days. That's the best era of Alice in Chains. Oh, yeah. We got this here fellow in this here truck going to the same place I'm going to. Very nice back here. I'm showing y'all some side views of Florence. Street, uh, the streets of Yazoo and Florence don't really look too much different, do they? No. No. <laughs> That's well, all. Well, they definitely feel different. That's for sure. It's a little different, yeah. Not as much turbulence on the road. Yeah. Yazoo roads are actually better than Byram, too. <laughs> oh, yeah. I don't know what's up with Hans County, but they got like the worst roads I've ever seen in my life. Got a very lovely stop sign right here for oh, your entertainment pleasure. How y'all like the part? We're gonna end the video here. No, not yet. Hold on. Okay. I'm gonna get that late. What's up, fella? Got somebody some... doing some four wheeler riding over there. Yep. A lot of dudes ride four wheelers in Florence because this country is hell, man. I get that lake. Oh, man. Get that lake. Yeah, here we go. Got a lovely lake over here. So look at this park we got. And some park. Look at that. Look at that park and that lake. Yeah. All right, guys. Uh, All right. Well, we're going to go ahead and wrap this up, man, because, I mean, ain't really much to this area, but I hope you enjoyed it. Well, actually, I don't give a shit if you enjoyed it. But uh, if you want to watch it, watch the motherfucker. Bullshit Productions. This is Mark and Jonathan. Bullshit saying, Productions. Saying goodbye, Bullshit Productions. Till next time.